2027, baby. <laughs> We're Lance and Christy. Join us as we build our dream. Welcome to Knight's Helm Farms. All right, we're back at it. After a very frustrating day yesterday, we got four panels up yesterday and they're all weird looking because we were using dish soap to try to get the, whatever that thing is called, the H wheel or whatever, on there. And so they're all slimy. But we finally got four. So there's two on that side on that side and then the ridge cap which you can just barely see the ridge cap up there um then some brainstorming i decided the dish soap is evaporating so we need something that doesn't evaporate but i didn't want to use a petroleum product obviously <laughs> that's no good and so i came up with the idea to use avocado oil and it seems to be working because we already have another panel up um, I have olive or avocado oil in a container put some on a rag use a spatula to guide the rag into the slot on the H rail and then we're not getting our hands all you know oily and gross everything is inside here because you you need something but just soap wasn't working that's a hundred degrees already this morning it's um what 89 already this morning we've been out here for about an hour already i didn't bring the camera because we weren't sure if it was going to work or not but anyway i have to tape these three panels that are down here on the cart and then we're going to try to get those up the problem with the morning temperatures it's a little cooler it's about 10 degrees cooler than the high for today however it's way 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 more humid very difficult you got sweat dripping in your eyes and you feel like you're standing in the shower with your clothes on but anyway so i'm gonna tape these guys and he's screwing in the one that we just put up don't forget you wanted to put more screws in that ridge cap too yeah. Before you get too far away from it, you know? Yeah. So, I'm too far away. I'm getting my tape and my scissors. We have more tape coming. This might be our determining factor as to when we take a break. <laughs> we have to wait on the tape. We'll be lucky if we have enough tape to do one more panel on it. Really? Yeah. Lucky. Alright, let's see if I have enough to do the other end of this one. 
I don't think so. And what, we can get out here until about 8? Yeah, we got here at 8. Okay. We clocked in at 8. Yeah. I have that much. And we can't do it after the things are on. Right. So. You gotta go get some. Yeah. I guess I could go make breakfast. We could run the tractor supply and see if they have it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yep. Jelly bean. We got one whole panel. Yeah, <laughs> we got one panel. But we found something that works. Yeah. And I was curious to see if it was because it was so hot yesterday is why it wasn't going on. Right. You think it'd be the other way around, but yeah. I don't think the temperature has anything to do with it. Uh, only for us. Only for us. But right now it's kind of miserable because it's so humid. Yeah. So the the temperature has gone up, and the humidity has gone up since yep. we got up this morning. Yep. And I think that's just because. You know, the dew is melting off and all that. The dew dew. Yeah. All right. Half. One and a half. <laughs> so, should I call Arthur and see cats and yeah. do chicken? Get a hold of them. See if he'll come. Did you get extra ones on the ridge cap? I got one extra one. I have to get to this side to go for Yeah, it. well that's easy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, one more panel up there. Much easier than yesterday. Yeah. And we just ran out of tape, so I gotta go get some more tape. Gives me hope. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, when you get back we'll have breakfast. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. 102 and 30% humidity. It's three o'clock in the afternoon. Our tape finally showed up and we have no choice but to come out and work because it's hot now but it'll be hot later and it'll be hot tomorrow so <sighs> just gotta deal with it I guess anyway I'm gonna give you a little close up while he's doing that. We are using olive oil on a rag, or actually avocado oil on a rag. 
being organic about it. With a spatula <laughs> stuck in there to get it into the H, you know, inside these pockets basically where the panels have to go. And then this is where the tape goes on the end to seal the edge. You can buy them already sealed, but they're way, way, way more expensive. So everybody just does the tape. And then you have to get this rail bed on there just right. And it's shorter on the bottom than it is on the top. So let me put the camera down and I'll help you. Then when you get it up top, you have to slide the panel with the rails onto the existing panel that's already on the roof. There, I just don't see that there's an easy way of doing this. Anyway, it's looking good. So I'll put you on super speed. All right, we got the third panel up on that side. I feel like I'm panting because it's so damn hot out here. Ooh. Third panel up on that side. And that one was difficult because there wasn't a rail on the back side of the second panel. So when we put the third panel up, it had two rails on it and then we couldn't feed it through the hole of the roof. So I had to go from the eaves, which made it more difficult. But we got it on there. And now he's putting the second ridge cap on because their panels are two foot a piece and then the ridge cap are four foot long. So I'll have to trim the back one. It'll end up being too long, but. Just putting it on as we go, that way he can reach the top of the building. And then, this is sort of a conundrum. Most, most people that build a greenhouse out of this stuff, they build a little short, you know, like seven foot high roof with walls that are only like eight by 10, but we decided to go way bigger. It's better to go bigger because then you don't wish that you had gone bigger and you don't have to build a second one. Have a whole bunch of little tiny ones. I don't, I would rather have one big one. But anyway, so now I have these two panels here are taped and these two rails are buttered, <laughs> for lack of a better word. And we're going to put one on each side up there. So like one right where he's standing and then one on the side in front of him. And we'll see how long that takes us. And how we feel because it's really hot it's down here on the on the deck in the shade it says it's 100 but here it says it's 110 yeah, I believe it so we're gonna have to take a break I think after this put the other two on after a break But at least they're going on. Better than yesterday. Although we haven't made any more progress than we did yesterday. It's just been a lot less frustrating. And the only reason that we had to stop today is because we were waiting on our delivery. Anyway. Yeah, it's break time. We got two panels on and three rails because we were behind by a rail on this side for some reason. And he went through and put screws at the very bottom of that row. You can kind of see the little screw heads right along there. So that if the wind comes up, because now all of a sudden it's, it's sprinkling and they are saying that there's a possibility of rain. We've got a lot of clouds. So. If it, if it blows, we don't want it taking our stuff and 
throwing it across the highway. <laughs> After the 42 hours it took us to get yes, the six up there. Exactly. Yeah. So we have two more that are ready to go. I got I got uh, taped in and I oiled them up and then Lance helped me get the rails on. So they are ready to go up there and be panel number seven and eight. Yeah. But we're gonna take a break first. Yep. Because it's hot and we need to make sure that we're taking care of ourselves. And, you know, we come first and yeah. the garden building comes second, secondary yes. to a lot of things. Yeah, secondary to a lot of things. Secondary to a lot of things and it takes as long as it takes. Yeah. So. 2027, baby. <laughs> Yeah, Thankfully, like we'll that. have other content between now and then. <laughs> yes. Yes. I don't think it's going to take that long, but it's taken a lot longer than I thought it was going to. Yeah. I thought these were going to be easy. I thought we'd have this done by the end of this week. I did too. Yeah. yeah. But no. It's All okay. Right. Yeah. All right. We'll get some drinks and, and then we'll come back out. Cool down. Yeah. Cool down. Yes. Okay. Okay, we're back. We're, we're kind of we're kind of cool. <laughs> <laughs> You're cool. Hey. Let's see. That right there says mm, maybe like 108. It might have gone down a little bit. Two billion degrees. Two billion. But we're gonna put one more on each side of the peak, and then finish attaching that ridge cap. So, which side do you want to work on first? That side, because the letters are over there. Yeah. So that's the one that's on top. No, because this will fit up through. It only has one thing on it. Oh my god. That was a one off deal, and that other one. So you need to move the ladder back through. Well, no, the thing starts down here. Oh, I see. Wherever the hell it is. Where am I at? This one. Yeah. Wherever. So where are you going to put it through? So you want this here? Right where this is? Is this in a good spot or no? Uh, Probably that way front there. Bang it. Don't bang it. Okay.
right now it doesn't feel too bad out here. It's because the sun's going down. It's going down. It's just killer lately. I don't understand it. The last two summers have been almost unbearable. Well, I was going from one letter to the next to the next, so I don't know when the camera stopped. But we just finished with that eighth panel. And so now he has to screw all of that in there. But that's where we're stopping today. Even though it's kind of nice weather out here now. Yeah. But we're dead. Dead. So I should see if I can show you what it looks like up there. Take the camera up. Take the camera up the ladder again. And then, uh, Gandalf, Mr. Gandalf, Mr. Pippin, his brother. <laughs> Did you know that Gandalf's brother was Pippin? <laughs> Only here. Only here. Okay, camera. Oh, there we go. So, sort of a bird's eye view. This is the last one we put on. And then this one, he leaves out the last screw so that we can Move it a little bit if we have to, to, to get the next panel up on this rail. Anyway, yeah, it's looking good. So it looks like this on both sides now. Four panels on each side. Eight out of 90. Yep. That's a lot. Yep. There's a lot of roof. Because it's about 15 panels wide and three panels from the peak down to the eaves. So 45 panels on the side. And we got four on the side. <sighs> but I think as we do it, it's gonna get easier. I said that yesterday, and I do believe that. The more we do it, the more we do it, the easier it'll get. Now we're, we're contemplating taking tomorrow off. Just do nothing. Are you taking tomorrow off? Last day. Last day. Before I go back. To the craziness? Yes. Yeah. 
the craziness. Can you do that one that's underneath? That's yeah. crazy. Yep. The other side's 100% done? Yeah. Okay. So you just gotta finish this panel. Great. Cool beans. Panel finishing. One more. One more on that, yeah. And then over there where the two pieces of whatever that stuff's called yeah, come so together. Yeah, it'll rise up. You should have put a screw down in between from one to the next, I think. Problem was, I couldn't reach that area anymore. Ah. Uh, You know that's gonna be that's gonna be the kind of the difficulty with doing these. Yeah, I know. Concurrently. I know, but that's the only way you'd be able to put that roof that ridge cap on. Yeah. What? I mean, maybe what? I should put the ridge cap on first, all the way down there, got it started, and then left it flipped up, and then put this panel and this panel up there. Yeah. Uh. But you know, it's better to have too many screws than not enough. I guess. Okay, so you just got three more rows. Three more of twelve, rows. and then an extra screw right here. Yeah, three rows of twelve. But I'm getting better at making sure I'm going down the same rows. Yeah, it looks good. Nice and straight. Yeah. I like it. It's time to do chores. Time to do chores. There's all the kitties that were in the air conditioning all day. That's it for today. Another semi-successful day. Yeah, yeah it was. It was successful. It was less frustrating. Yeah. Yeah. And less. Well, equally productive as yesterday, which was totally frustrating. However, the reason we didn't get as much done today is because we were waiting for tape. Yeah. So nothing we can do about it. True. All right. Yep. See you. Okay. Catch you on the next one. Yes. Bye.